Hey there, in today's video, I wanna teach you how to enable email notifications in Tutor LMS. Now, this is gonna be for two reasons. If you want, technically three reasons. If you want students to be aware of certain bits of progress that are happening, if you want um, the owner of the website itself, the administrators to be aware of what's going on, and then if you want the actual instructor to be involved and get email notifications around what's happening, you get all of these settings in Tutor LMS, but they're not turned on by default, and it may take you some time to figure out where to find them. So I want to help you in this video, make that a much quicker process for you. If you're new around here, my name is Steve Schramm. I talk about WordPress sales funnels and e-learning websites and, and building courses and really helping get your message out to the world. If that's something you're interested in, give me a subscribe. I would love to help you out. Okay. So without further ado, let's dive right in and take a look. So I have a website here on which I have Tutor LMS installed. And by default, if you were to go into the settings, and uh, it's actually really nice what they give you here, you get even this search area here. You notice there's no uh, email um, listing over here. And then if you search here for email uh, to get email notifications, you are going to find no results found. And it's like, okay, well, <laughs> can't this thing notify me or notify my students or whatever when things are happening? And the answer is yes, it can. Uh, and by default, you won't have to pay any more for this if you've got, I've got their lifetime version. I'm not quite sure what's available only in free, but if you are a, um, a paid member of this, you definitely get access to email notifications. And I'm guessing they have that in the free version as well. Okay. Here's how you turn it on. What you do is go over here to your add-ons. So we go to add-ons and we're going to scroll through here and look, and they've got quite a number of great add-ons. Some of them uh, require additional plugins and some of these you have to pay for. And most of them you do not. You notice right here that email is an add-on and it says send email on various tutor events. So what you do is just come turn that on and that's it. Okay. It activates it. And now when we go to settings, now in the past, this took it a minute or two to show up. Here we go. It's right there. So now we see email over here on the side and we click here. We get a world of options. Of course, we can set the logo templates. We can disable the banner altogether, change the name, change the reply to email, the footer text. You see, you have a lot of options. And now here you have email to students and email to teachers, and then just email sending settings in general about using WP Cron and things of that nature. We also have email to admin. So you see, you can change your admin emails, your instructor or teacher emails, and also your email students. And they have quite a bit of information here. You can have emails sent uh, at different uh, various pieces of the puzzle in terms of like when a course is completed or when an assignment has been graded, Q&A has been um, answered, enrollment has expired, etc. You have lots of fantastic options here for notifying all the people who need to be notified. Of course, if you want to turn an email on and edit it, you just come right here to edit. And it gives you this super awesome little tool here uh, where you can make your changes over here in the template. And then it gives you the template preview right here. Very neat. You can even send a test email. So that's it. That's how you get email configured in Tutor LMS. I hope you find this useful and help you. Like I've mentioned, give a like and subscribe, leave a comment. If this was helpful for you, I love interacting with people here in the YouTube community. Thank you so much for uh, tuning in and we'll catch you in the next video.